Listen, we all know what it feels like to be alone. Maybe you've gotten lost in a store before. Or some people feel alone when the lights go out at night. Some people even feel alone when they're surrounded by people they don't know. Feeling alone can be uncomfortable, even scary. <gasps> Think of Joseph. Joseph was betrayed by his own brothers, thrown into a dark well, and sold as a slave to Egypt. He must have felt all alone. But during all of that, the writer of Genesis wrote, the Lord was with Joseph. God was with Joseph at home. He was with Joseph in the well, and he was with Joseph in Egypt. And here's something you may not realize. God is with you too. But if you're anything like me, you may have to remind yourself that God is with you. And there's something we can do. It's the same something that Jesus did. A lot of the times when Jesus felt alone, he prayed. When he felt sad and exhausted, Jesus prayed. Or when he just wanted to spend time with God, he prayed. So hold please. Okay, I prayed. I'm still in the woods, I still can't sleep, and there's still strange noises outside of my tent. But somehow I don't feel as alone anymore. Talking to God helps remind me that he's always with me. I'm gonna ignore that. <laughs> so, the one thing to remember today is this. When you think you're alone, you can trust God is with you. But if you don't remember, tip number one, pray. Tip number two, pray. And tip number three, pray. And if you do that, maybe being alone won't be so scary. Okay, I'm gonna try and get some sleep now. I'll see you tomorrow morning. Or, or on second thought, maybe I'll just stay up and pray. Yeah, yeah, that sounds like a good idea. <laughs>